Now, what they found in studying narcissist brains is that there's reduced gray matter in actually both of these areas of the brain. So if you don't know uh, the, sort of the anatomy of brains and how that works, gray matter, there's gray matter and there's white matter. That's the big di two sort of distinctions in the brain. And that's just the color. That's why they call them that gray or white. And, and there's different colors for different parts of the cells of our brain, the neurons. So the gray matter is the nucleus or the actual cells. So if you have more gray matter, you have more cells. And if you have less gray matter, you have less cells. And the white matter are the uh, connections. So the axons and dendrites, <clears throat> but basically the wiring between um, uh, the cells. So when they see less gray matter in these areas, that means there are actually a, a smaller amount of brain in those sections or less, um, you know, less, less neural cells. So, you know, real simply put, the more gray matter you have in a certain part of the brain, the more active that area is, the less you have, the less active that is.